My name is Aaron Doncaster. This is my second day, third day actually, um, at Occupy. Um, I wish I could stay in camp here all the time. Unfortunately, I have a job that I have to return to uh, in a couple of days, but I get two more days down here in Calgary before I go back to uh, Lake Louise. I just wanted to uh, say hello to all our brothers and sisters in the Occupy movement across the country and across North America, across the world, and bring a little bit of an update today. Today was a, like my brother said, a fascinating day, an interesting day. A day that started with a qualitatively different energy than what it ended with. And that's okay. Because there's going to be tough times. There's going to be hills to climb. There's going to be challenges. There's going to be barriers in our way. This is not going to be easy for us. We know what we're up against. But we know what we're capable of when we look inside our souls, when we look inside our hearts that we can truly become the best that we can be. Like I said, today started off with a qualitatively different energy than it, than it ended with. And we were having a, a few issues with what happened last night. Uh, some issues with some people that were drinking. We've come to a consensus that we decided this is going to be a drug-free zone, uh, regardless of some individual's beliefs on uh, drugs one way or the other. Um, I think that uh, seeing like this is a, a park that we're in, um, we want to be able to choose our battles. And um, even though I'm uh, for the uh, elimination of drug prohibition, uh, I feel it is necessary that uh, if we want to keep our eyes on the prize, uh, well, you know, there are some compromises that we're going to have to make. Um, we also tried to put up a, uh, uh, a yoga tent uh, that was a wooden structure and uh, by law told us that we had to take it down. Um, we're checking out with by law to see if we can put it back up. And, uh, and hopefully we can. Um, then afternoon, um, when I came back, uh, I went out to do some uh, internet stuff of my own. Came back for the GA, and there was such a positive energy. People were committed. It was amazing to see the commitment that was shown by brothers and sisters that were here today. And then, at the end, we, we came together and uh, had a sing-song. And after the sing-song, we did some chants, and our energy was still high. And we ended it in a very, a very positive way. But, you know, um, putting together a brainstorming session about our mission statement, we were inspired by uh, not only all the all the occupies out there, but specifically the um, the Ottawa one that uh, I happen to see. I'm, I'm, I'm sure there are other ones that came up with it. Uh oh. It's okay. It's still recording. Okay. Oh, you might. Oh, oh, you're getting burnt. You're burning. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just set myself on fire. Yeah. And I'm going to do it again. Okay, is it recording now? Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Okay, uh, we're back. Sorry about that. Um, little technical difficulties. We were we're having a few small technical difficulties here at Occupy Calgary, but we've gotten over them. So, like I was saying, um, yeah, we uh, we ended with that brainstorming session um, about our mission statement, and uh, we got a. Uh, it written down. We also got it on camera, which is a great thing. And uh, here's one of our comrades behind us. Uh, 
waves to the camera. Oh, come on. They want to say they want to see you. Say hi to everybody across the world. Hi everybody across the world. Awesome. And uh, live no. no, no. This is just a, a an update of our our daily actions and I'm I'm taking too long, but you're going to cut it probably a bit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> I don't know that I can. Oh, you don't know? What you, okay, so I'm going to end this soon, uh, maybe in about a minute. Um, I'm inspired. Um, I saw a, a big change today. People are committed to actually staying. And uh, I'm, I'm, not, uh, I'm not expecting, uh, you know, that it's going to be easy. And I'm sure that uh, many of us out there have have felt uh, a lot of uh, difficulties too. And uh, it's it's not going to be easy. It's not easy building a new world. It's not easy building free relationships with others when for so long we've been told how we're supposed to act. We're becoming more aware. The world is changing, hopefully for the better. And I think we need to realize that um, challenges are going to pop up. It's not a utopia. And we just need to build constructive methods of conflict resolution and constructive methods of communication. Um, I'm inspired. Um, I've actually thought about quitting my job, <laughs> which it, it kind of scares me a little bit because it took me a year or so to get this job. But uh, yeah, I'm really inspired and I'm going to be here until I have to go back to my job. And if I quit my job, I'll be here for good. If not, I'll be here on every uh, day off. And uh, I just want to say uh, that uh, we're sending our love out to everybody else and we're uh, we're sending our positive energies and uh, we're sending our optimism we're sending our solidarity and we want to thank you all for inspiring us to be here today and to be part of a movement that is bigger than the total sum of any one individual it is amazing thank you very much